guys welcome back to my channel my name is penny if you're new it's great to meet you and if you're an existing viewer welcome back so today guys uh, i got more pumpkins <laughs> i promise crisscross with all my heart i can't make that promise guys i shouldn't have done that i cannot make that promise but i hope this will be my last pumpkin haul that he knows about at least because i think if he <laughs> see his face if he sees another pumpkin i think he's gonna slap me <laughs> he's nodding guys i don't think he's seen so many pumpkins in all his life I don't like your pumpkins. you do like my pumpkins no. you don't like them oh, I, I thought you said you don't like them no, look at no seriously now all my pumpkins echo what do you think? It's lovely. Really? It's really nice. He's not happy, guys. He's saying it's lovely, but he's not happy. <laughs> First of all, let's address the fact. Same hair, same makeup. Um, same, same top day. as my last video. What? Same day. Yeah, it is the same day, actually. I am filming everything in bulk on the same day. Um... I did a try on, I did a boot sale, and now I'm doing this one. I think that's it for one day, guys, because it takes a lot of time, all the filming and the editing and all that malarkey. It does take a long time. I hope you appreciate it. I do it for you guys. <laughs> Give me a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button, guys. <laughs> right then, let's get on with it. So I've got one, two, three, four. I've got six things from Georgia Tasta, one thing from Amazon, one thing from eBay and one thing, no, three things from Shein. So let's get on with it. My first thing, guys. <gasps> Look at that. Now I'm not taking the lids off, guys, because when I did that on the cast iron casserole dish, the lid fell off and I ended up with a bruise and a half on my knee. It blooming kills. I thought I chipped a bone. <coughs> That's just Luna. It was bloody heavy, that lid. It really hurt. So I'm not taking lids off. I'm just going to show you. So it's got, um, what are they called? Like an elastic band type of thing on it to keep the lid on. But, this was £12, 10 or £12, it is stunning, it's as big as my head, it is gorgeous and it's a, they're calling it an oven to table way, now I don't think this would be able to go in the oven, what are they calling it, pumpkin serving bowl. So it's just a serving bowl, guys. This, I probably, I'm not even going to use it. It's going to be a display piece. I love it. You know I love my pumpkins. And it's going to live in my kitchen. It may even live out year round. Because that is too beautiful to put away. I love it. What do you think, guys? Tell me. Or are you all fed up with my pumpkin? <laughs> Sorry, guys. <laughs> Luna, shush! Don't answer me back! She always plays up when I'm filming. Then, again, from Asda. Oh, look at that! I saw this. Well, I didn't. I saw the next one, but it was very similar. On a Lange channel, Silver Moonlight. She's got... Um, it's very, very similar, but hers was from Next. So she did say that Asda had them and it was a lot cheaper. Uh, I think this was £7. I, don't, I haven't got the receipt, guys, so I don't know. But <gasps> stunning! Now, I don't always drink tea. I do drink more coffee. So if I'm going to use it, that would hold a couple of cups of coffee. So I would just make it in here and just pour it from here into my pumpkin mug. Because, yes, guys, I do have pumpkin mugs as well that I got last year in Poundland. But I've only got three. I don't know what happens. I thought I had four. So if Poundland have any more in, I'm going to try and get another one. 
if not it's not to be and we've just got three but i hate things that don't sort of match up i mean you've got to have four guys not that anyone's going to drink out of them they're for show <laughs> i'll drink out of one you want to see the looks i'm getting off the husband guys she has a problem guys they're not going to hear you you've got to speak up she has a problem guys i do have a problem and i'm the first to admit it but i love him so it just says pumpkin teapot because <laughs> that's what it is <laughs> to drink guys love it absolutely love it and i'm really really happy to have it and you'll be glad to know i didn't have to travel to every asda within the vicinity that was in the first asda i went to and they had shelves full they had lots of them but this next thing they only had one off so i snapped it up again it was seven pounds and it's a gorgeous pumpkin plate. How lovely. I love it. What does it say? It just says pumpkin serving plate. Oh, I love it. And is it? It's dishwasher safe, but it's not suitable for the microwave. Do not put this in the micro, mister. No. But it is dishwasher safe, but... It's going to be hand washed. I'm not taking any chances. How gorgeous. I love it. Can you imagine a plate full of sandwiches? Biscuits. Or biscuits, whatever. Put my cup or in my lovely pumpkin teapot into my pumpkin mug. Oh my God, guys, I'm so happy. And then I've got a little pumpkin dish as well. <laughs> All Georgia Tasta is just a little bowl, it just says pumpkin bowl. Now, it could be used for potpourri, um, it could be used for a candle, a plant, um, lights, battery operated lights. It could be used for soup and bread, or stew and bread, stew and a lovely crusty roll on the side. This could have numerous uses. I think this was three pounds. That was seven pounds. Oh, I love them. I'm so happy. I think everyone is sort of joining the pumpkin trend this year because I swear there wasn't that much around last year. It was only sort of home bargains and pound land that you could get stuff from. So yeah, I'm really happy. Please excuse my one dog. That's the pug you can hear. It sounds like a baby crying when he starts. He sort of howls. Can you hear him? He wants attention, but he's not having it because I'm filming. Oh, it looks like Howard's going to go out and give him attention. He's in the other room. He's in the kitchen. And he's just sat there going, ow, ow. <laughs> Oh, if you've got a pug, you'll understand. Um, right two more things from judge i've got the white pumpkin it's a soap dispenser but i'm figuring i'm gonna put hand cream in that and i'm gonna have that upstairs and that's gonna be out year round um and that i think is just a little tot brush mug but it's not i'm not gonna use it for that i'm gonna either put bobbles in it or some brushes or little clippings the little things i got in my hair um little bits and bobs at the side of the bed so yeah i really like it this was five this was three and i do believe that um oh next i've got these and i think they are 10 pounds i may be wrong i'm sure i heard they were 10 pounds so yeah a lot of these things you can find in next but why pay more when georgia has day have got things that are very very similar if not the same now i would have preferred these to have been in the orange 
but then maybe I would have had too much orange maybe the white will break it up a bit because my decor is out I've got all my pumpkins out everywhere and I'm just looking around now and predominantly they are white and orange I've got some green ones I've got a couple of neutral ones um, they're all over the place but yeah a lot of them are white or cream and orange so they are going to match so let's put those down the next thing I've got are from Next. Now, I didn't get them from Next. I got them off eBay. And they are the little salt shaker and pepper shaker. How stunning are they? Now, I don't know how much they would have been from Next. I think they were around last year. I don't know if they're around this year. I believe they came on a little tray, but I didn't get them on a little tray. I just got them as they are. I've been told they've not been used. I've taken the stoppers off the bottom and I can tell you that there are no, there's no evidence of any salt or pepper having been in there. So basically they're brand new. Um, how much did I pay? Um, let me find out a second. Uh, eBay. Purchases. pound I don't know how much they would have been as I said in next but yeah I really love them and they match everything perfectly right last couple of bits and you'll be glad to know they're not pumpkins or even pumpkin related but they are Halloween related so on eBay, I got these Vampire Tears candles. They're black taper candles and they bleed when lit. They smell insane. They smell like incense. Oh, I love the smell of incense. I love the smell of these. So I'm going to open them for you. They're just basically black taper candles and I'm going to put them, can you remember my B&M haul and I had a, well I've got over there, the Ravenclaw um, candlestick, why am I doing that? It was a cast iron Ravenclaw candlestick and I'm thinking put one of those in, when it starts to burn down I'm going to drip the wet, wet wax, <laughs> I'm going to drip the red wax down onto the actual candlestick so it'll look like blood <laughs> I know I'm weird like that so yeah I cannot wait to start burning those now that I've shown you I can burn them oh they smell gorgeous so there were four in a pack and again I'm gonna have a look and tell you how much they were bear with me a second Um, these were, they were a fiver, guys. A four. Sorry, it reached the maximum, I can't speak, the maximum recording time. Really happy with those and, uh, yeah, I can't wait to start burning them. Last few items. Now, this isn't going to be to everyone's taste. It's. Well, it freaks my daughter out something stupid, but it's for my bedroom, and it's a, let me open it, it's a Ouija board, I just want to open the whole thing, it's a Ouija board um, double duvet, double duvet cover I should say, with two pillowcases, hubby bought me this, I think it was about £15. There's the pillowcases. There's two of them. So, yeah. Can't wait to get that on the bed. Um, my daughter don't like anything Ouija board related. I used to do ghost tents. And I've actually got a Ouija board. And it freaks her out. So, I'm not allowed to have it out. So, I've been told that these have got to go in the bedroom. They can't stay downstairs. So, I've got cushion covers. These were off Shein. And they're really well made. They've even got zips in. 
these were are they a pound each or two pounds each something silly guys so yeah i got two of those exactly the same and they're just gonna go on the bed as well and you know the material feels different on both of them but they're the same yeah they've been made out of different material this one feels stiffer plain back on the white <laughs> white on the back i always do that guys that's my fibro <laughs> my words come out wrong all the time i'm the only one who knows what i mean and then i've got this one which is like a um a bolster i guess i don't know what you call it but it's a long pillow so i'm gonna have the uh the two on the two pillows and that one in the middle so yeah really really happy so that was she in so that's the end of my uh Halloween haul guys, my pumpkin haul with a little bit of uh, darkness thrown in. <laughs> oh, who used to like the darkness? <laughs> I did. Um, anyway, I hope you enjoyed. Please tell me in the comments which was your favourite. Um, I'd be hard pressed to pick because I love it all. Um, thank you so much for watching. Take care of each other. Stay well, stay safe. Please subscribe and give me a thumbs up and I'll see you in my next video guys. Bye.